Hello everybody and welcome to Brooklyn, New York, where I currently am. Picking up where I left off after uh, add some music to your day. Doing these feel flows, five minute feels to reels videos about the songs on the two albums featured by the recent box set release of the Beach Boys uh, covering their albums Sunflower and Surf's Up. And if uh, it keeps going well, I may do some outtakes too. Just briefly discussing uh, the sort of musical elements behind the songs, not caring too much about production or performance right now, but just talking about the songs in small bite-sized pieces. Um, we are on track four of Sunflower now, which is called Got to Know the Woman. It's a Dennis Wilson song. And not unlike Add Some Music to Your Day, it's uh, perhaps not that interesting of a song on its own. There's a little bit of novelty, and that's what I'm going to discuss. But uh, it is by and large a sort of classic blues rock, saloony kind of number with the tack piano. Um, the performance, I think we can all agree, Dennis has a great lead vocal, great backing vocals. Um, Honeycomb comes in and does those great backing vocals in the section we're going to talk about. And typical good uh, Steve Desper production. Great performances from, from everybody. Um, but musically speaking, the only thing that really sticks out in the song is the this moment in the song where it breaks down from the normal blues rock format. Um, it goes into this turnaround the first time. Um, got to know the woman. Oh, got to know the woman. Then repeats. If you And then when it comes to that part again, you expect the same thing, maybe. Got to know the woman, yeah, got to know the woman. But instead, it starts this unique part of the piece where there's this um, ever ascending sequence of modulations over the chord. So we start on the G chord in the bass, or a G in the bass over a G chord. And then it will briefly go down a whole step in the right hand in the harmony to an F chord, or you could call it a G, uh, G11 or something. Uh, got to know the woman, got to know the woman. And then comes the upward modulation, which is a whole step, which really adds drama to the upward movement. So, got to know the woman. Then again. Got to know the woman. And then, because we have to get back to the home key of C, it's another, uh, it's a half step instead of a whole step. So. Got to, got to, got to know the woman. And then we can get back into it. Uh, and then the second time through, because the song's ending and we don't have to get back to C, it just keeps going upward whole step at a time, I think, so. Got to know the woman, got to know the woman, got to know the woman, got to, got to, got to, got to know the woman. I think it ends on G, maybe. Um, so the upward movement, I think, really adds to the sort of maybe the thing that Dennis was getting at, this rising up into ecstasy. Um, and the whole step, upward modulation at a time, I think is much more dramatic than if it had just been half steps. So if it had just been... Got to know the woman Got to know the woman Got to know the woman It's, it's not as uh, ecstatic. It's, it's more... It's not dramatic enough to really make you 
sit up and, and take notice. Like, wow, that really went up. Got to know the woman. 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 So, um, that's kind of the, the musically interesting part. It's really benefited by the great backing vocals there, Honeycomb. Mike Love's great little... Uh, Got to know the woman, ooh, mow, mow, mow. I can't even do it. He's such a genius. His work cannot be replicated. Um, anyway, that's what I have to say about Got to Know the Woman. Next up, we've got um, the Deirdre. Or is it? It's Bruce Johnson's song, which I never really pictured myself uh, analyzing, but here we are. I'm going to do it. Got to do every song in the sequence. Otherwise, if you're not going to do something properly, why do it at all? Um, yeah, so thanks for watching. Going to keep doing these. Please check out the Beach Boys, uh, Sunflower, and Surf's Up Records, either by themselves or as part of the Field Flows box set. If you're not familiar with this, time in their lives. I think you'll appreciate it and be surprised. Uh, stay tuned in the future. I'm here in Brooklyn to retrieve, mainly to retrieve, a lot of my instruments, which will be used then in uh, uh, an unprecedentedly nerdy chapter of Beach Boy Scholarship, where I'm going to just break down every aspect of the production of Summer Days, Pet Sounds, and the Smile Sessions at a level of detail that I think will frighten most people. Um, so look forward to that. Look forward to the next episode of 5-Minute Feel Flows, Feels to Reels. We'll see you around. Thank you for watching. <laughs>